A Wheatstone bridge is an electrical circuit used to measure an unknown electrical resistance by balancing two legs of a bridge circuit, one leg of which includes the unknown component. The primary benefit of the circuit is its ability to provide extremely accurate measurements in contrast with something like a simple voltage divider. Its operation is similar to the original potentiometer. The Wheatstone Bridge was invented by Samuel Hunter Christie in 1833 and improved and popularized by Sir Charles Wheatstone in 1843. One of the Wheatstone Bridge's initial uses was for the purpose of soils analysis and comparison. Topic. Operation In the figure R X Display style script style R underscore X is the fixed, yet unknown, resistance to be measured. R one Display style script style R underscore one R two Display style script style R underscore two and R three Display style script style R underscore three are resistors of known resistance and the resistance of R two Display style script style R underscore two is adjustable. The resistance R two Display style script style R underscore two is adjusted until the bridge is balanced and no current flows through the galvanometer v g display style script style v underscore g at this point the voltage between the two midpoints b and d will be zero therefore the ratio of the two resistances in the known leg r 2 r 1 Display style script style r underscore two r underscore one is equal to the ratio of the two resistances in the unknown leg r x r three display style script style r underscore x r underscore three. If the bridge is unbalanced, the direction of the current indicates whether r two Display style script style r underscore two is too high or too low. At the point of balance, r two r one equals r x r three r x equals r two r one r three. Display style begin aligned frac r underscore two r underscore one and equals frac r underscore x r underscore three four p t right arrow r underscore x and equals frac r underscore two r underscore one c d o t r underscore three end aligned detecting zero current with a galvanometer can be done to extremely high precision. Therefore, if R 1 display style script style R underscore 1 R 2 display style script style R underscore 2 and R 3 display style script style R underscore 3 are known to high precision then r x display style script style r underscore x can be measured to high precision very small changes in r x display style script style r underscore x disrupt the balance and are readily detected alternatively if r one display style script style r underscore one r two display style script style r underscore two and r three display style script style r underscore three are known, but r two display style script style r underscore two 
is not adjustable, the voltage difference across or current flow through the meter can be used to calculate the value of R x display style script style R underscore x using Kirchhoff's circuit laws. This setup is frequently used in strain gauge and resistance thermometer measurements, as it is usually faster to read a voltage level off a meter than to adjust a resistance to zero the voltage. Topic derivation First, Kirchhoff's first law is used to find the currents in junctions B and D, I3 minus IX plus IG equals 0, I1 minus I2 minus IG equals 0, display style, begin, aligned, I underscore 3, I underscore X plus I underscore G and equals 0, I underscore 1, I underscore 2, I underscore G and equals 0, end, aligned, then, Kirchhoff's second law is used for finding the voltage voltage in the loops ABID and BCD, I3 R3, minus I G R G, minus I 1 R1 equals 0 I X R X minus I2 R2 plus I G R G equals 0 display style begin aligned I underscore 3 C D O T R underscore 3 I underscore G C D O T R underscore G I underscore 1 C D O T R underscore 1 and equals 0 I underscore X C D O T R underscore X I underscore 2 C D O T R underscore two plus I underscore G C D O T R underscore G and equals zero end aligned when the bridge is balanced, then I G equals zero. So the second set of equations can be rewritten as I three R three equals I one R one one I X R X equals I two R two two display style begin aligned I underscore three C D O T R underscore three and equals I underscore one C D O T R underscore one quad text one I underscore X C D O T R underscore X and equals I underscore two C D O T R underscore two quad text two end aligned then Equation 1 is divided by equation 2 and the resulting equation is rearranged, giving, Rx equals R2 I2 I3 R3 R1 I1 I X Display style R underscore X equals R underscore two C D O T I underscore two C D O T I underscore three C D O T R underscore three over R underscore one C D O T I underscore one C D O T I underscore X due to I three Topic X and I one I2 being proportional from Kirchhoff's first law in the above equation I3 I2 over I1 X cancel out of the above equation. The desired value of R X is now known to be given as R X equals R 3 R 2 R 1 Display style R underscore X equals R underscore three C D O T R underscore two over R underscore one. On the other hand, if the resistance of the galvanometer is high enough that I G is negligible, it is possible to compute R X from the three other resistor values and the supply voltage V S, or the supply voltage from all four resistor values. To do so, one has to work out the voltage from each potential divider and subtract one from the other. The equations for this are V G equals R 2 R 1 plus R 2 minus R X R X plus R three V S R X equals 
R2 vs minus R1 plus R2 VGR1 vs plus R1 plus R2 VGR3 display style begin aligned V underscore G and equals left R underscore 2 over R underscore 1 plus R underscore 2 R underscore X over R underscore X plus R underscore 3 right V underscore s 6 PT R underscore X and equals R underscore two C D O T V underscore S R underscore one plus R underscore two C D O T V underscore G over R underscore one C D O T V underscore S plus R underscore one plus R underscore two C D O T V underscore G R underscore three end aligned where V G is the voltage of node D relative to node B. Topic Significance The Wheatstone Bridge illustrates the concept of a difference measurement, which can be extremely accurate. Variations on the Wheatstone Bridge can be used to measure capacitance, inductance, impedance and other quantities, such as the amount of combustible gases in a sample, with an explosimeter. The Kelvin Bridge was specially adapted from the Wheatstone Bridge for measuring very low resistances. In many cases, the significance of measuring the unknown resistance is related to measuring the impact of some physical phenomenon such as force, temperature, pressure, etc. which thereby allows the use of Wheatstone Bridge in measuring those elements indirectly. The concept was extended to alternating current measurements by James Clerk Maxwell in 1865 and further improved as Blumline Bridge by Alan Blumline around 1926. Topic. Modifications of the fundamental bridge The Wheatstone Bridge is the fundamental bridge, but there are other modifications that can be made to measure various kinds of resistances when the fundamental Wheatstone Bridge is not suitable. Some of the modifications are Carey Foster Bridge, for measuring small resistances Kelvin Bridge, for measuring small four-terminal resistances Maxwell Bridge, and Wien Bridge for measuring reactive components. Topic. See also Diode Bridge, Product Mixer, Diode Bridges Phantom Circuit, a circuit using a balanced bridge Post Office Box, Electricity Potentiometer, Measuring Instrument Potential divider Ohmmeter Resistance thermometer Strain gauge